fought so hard yourself to get the redevelopment. How excited are you personally about 2014 and actually seeing all the hard work you've put in sort of come to fruition, if you like? It's it, Yeah, we're in it now, really, Elliot, because they were having meetings and seeing things happen, plans being drawn up. So, yeah, it's, it's very, very exciting. I'm really, really looking forward to it, you know, finally happening and seeing it, actually seeing it happen, seeing the builders here, seeing the building work going ahead. But we need to get our league position sorted out and, and, and fast. And that's to me, is in the short term is far more important than um you know the building work so it had yeah that we have to solve that one you know the building works will happen we will get that done and say delighted with that but we have to solve our league position it's a case isn't it it's all marrying the two you want the sort of on-field success to go with the redevelopment you do yeah of course you do and yeah any club in league two finances don't make sense but if we have if we're in league one and we've got boxes and the conference and everything generating money with the you know the additional money that League One generates. We're in a really good position, really good position. When we spoke a few weeks ago, you said you'd hope to have a lot of the redevelopment, especially on the East End, completed by the start of next season. Is that still the case? Still the case, yeah, yeah. We're um, just just come out of meeting literally five minutes ago, talking about when the roof can come off and um, you know basically the earlier we can get the roof off and start some of the work even during this season the quicker that we can get it done for the beginning of next season so the, all these sort of things going on we, we fully expect to be um, you know functional maybe not 100% but 80-90% functional by the beginning of next season